What is good, Grey Gang? If you saw the title, we're actually doing a one hour pond hopping mystery box fishing challenge. Now, I know that's a long title and it seems like there's a lot going on, and that's because there is. I have two different ponds that I'm going out to fish today, and I only have one hour to fish with them. The really important thing about that is that these ponds are not close together at all, and I actually can't go to both of them with the same vehicle. One of them is in the backwoods, I straight up have to take the mule, and then one of them is actually I have to get on the main road, go down a little bit, and then I have to drive my truck to get there. So that there alone cuts down on my time. I'm not going to have a ton of time to fish today. I've got to make it quick. I've got to cast with a purpose, I guess you may say. i got to make every cast count because, you know, I'm going to be burning up at least 15 minutes just driving there. But anyways, guys, right now, if you can see that, it's actually 6.04. That means at 7.04, I'll give myself 7.05. I don't care. Yeah, I'm a cheater. I gave myself an extra minute. So without further ado, well, shoot, boys. We're gonna go ahead and get started. Like I said, the first one, we're going back into the backwoods. And there's one more aspect to this challenge. I've got a mystery tackle box in the back there full of fishing bait that I have no idea what they are, and that's the only things I can use. So, uh, yeah, I really don't know what I'm getting myself into. And it's already like 7.07, .07, guys. I gotta go. I'll see you at the pond. Okay, guys, we're at the first pond here. I think I said this was a backwoods pond, but uh, I think they kind of shaved the pond a little bit. There ain't no more woods here. But nevertheless, guys, I don't think they care. I think the fish are still going to buy. As for the specific goal, what are we trying to get? I don't know. I'm just trying to catch fish. Hey, don't come out here trying to put pressure on me like that. Oh, gosh, I got to check the time. Oh, it's stinking 16. I've already wasted five minutes just trying to get here. Now, like I said, guys, we're going to two different ponds. I'm going to give you the profiles right now. Coming up on our first pond, commonly referred to as the Backwoods Pond, has recently got a haircut. But will that stop the bass from munching on Kendall's bait? Well, by golly, let's hope not. Coming in with a water clarity of around three and a half feet, this pond flaunts three amazing laydowns. Serving as perfect staging areas for big female bass. Better watch your feet as stepping in the wrong spot at this pond could leave you at the bottom of a beaver hook. And that there is pond number one. Coming in with a water clarity of 1.5 feet, pond number two. This pond is composed of numerous different types of structure and cover, along with some riprap over here on the right side, some random looking cattails on the left, and then a big random sprinkler thingy that I've never seen turned on out there in the middle. Oh my gosh, I just saw a bass. What a coincidence. What a miracle. What a tragedy. Now pond number two has something special about it. Statistically, there is at least one bass in this pond. This here is pond number two. Okay, guys, enough messing around. It's stinking. It's already like 6.15. I've spent 10 minutes just trying to... Oh, my gosh. I don't even know what I'm doing, but i got to open up this box because whatever's in this box is what I have to catch fish with here. And let me tell you, guys, I don't know about you, but I don't even need pliers to... Oh, my gosh. Sit here. Oh. <laughs> Okay, we got it. Oh my, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, what we got, what we got? Okay, looks like this is what we got. First thing I'm seeing, we got a little red crankbait. I think that's gonna be money, guys. I mean, it's warmed up these last couple days. That thing should be butter. I'm definitely gonna throw this first. Right here looks like we got some big old swim baits. We may use those if it's slow. Over here, we got some big old larva things. I don't know, maybe we'll catch a butterfly with that. I'm not a bass fishing professional. And then right here looks like a combo match made in heaven. We have everything you need for a drop shot. We got drop shot weights, a drop shot hook, and then these little shimmer shad right here. They're like extremely small. I used these some last year, and let me tell you boys, I caught a 12 inch spotted bass. Not trying to brag, but I'd like to see you do better. But enough wasting time, guys. Oh wait, I almost forgot one bait. It's stuck in there. Oh, it's this giant swim bait. Don't see that catching me a bluegill. Okay guys, enough wasting time. I'm talking. We gotta sneak and catch a fish. Or more than one fish. Fishes. Oh gosh. God goodness. That's what I get, guys. I wasn't watching where I was stepping and went right down in the punji pit. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna throw y'all on over to the GoPro. Oh my goodness, dude. It's already stinking 616. I'm already 11 minutes into this and I ain't even made my first cast. But anyways, oh yeah, okay, let me turn up the GoPro a little bit. Now we're ready, dude. This is actually a little wake bait. It's not 100% square bill. But it's a little wake bait, so it goes a little bit shallower than most square bills, which per personally, I like that because, you know, I think I'm about to slay them. I don't know how active the bass are going to be, but I tell you what, we're, they're going to have to bite because uh, I'm trying to make a YouTube video and I only have an hour to catch them. Can't really spend all day. Hello? Come on, Betty. Let me just hook you in the face and I'll leave you alone till tomorrow. 
if you guys are interested at all in the box that you know i'm actually using the baits from that is a mystery tackle box they're a subscription-based company which every month they send you a box just like that that right there that was one of april boxes and they'll send you a box like that every single month just packed full of stuff and if you're really looking into it and you never used it before use my promo code and it'll actually get your first box as low as ten dollars so if you're interested go ahead and use the link in the description and use my promo code gray game now let's go ahead and catch me a stink of bass because i don't have all day y'all know that i have an hour I, I really need to set up some limits i'm already like 10 minutes in i've only got like what 45 minutes left i need to set a time limit to where i need to leave this pond i also need to set up a time limit to where i need to switch over to you know switch baits and stuff in case this little wake bait ain't working oh my gosh <laughs> Uh, uh, I'm getting nervous, guys. I'm getting nervous. Wow, Kendall. You're really on one today. Thanks, man. Glad to meet you. Okay, guys. I hate to say it, but uh, I've threw about five casts with this thing, and I've not caught a bass. They ain't here. I'm leaving. Maybe I'm reeling it too fast. Maybe it's not going deep enough. Maybe there's no fish in the pond. Why is that never an option? Nope. There's a fish. There's a fish in this pond, son. These big ones. Oh my gosh, this may be my PB. Oh, oh no. No, he's in a tree. He's in a, okay, okay, okay. I've got to get over here where I can land him. I didn't even know if I was going to catch a fish today. Oh my gosh, I'm just going to flip him. Oh, wow, he's a pounder. Gotta love it when you think they're 10 times bigger than they actually are. By the way, guys, I want 10,000 likes. I don't know why I want 10,000 likes. I just want them. Mainly because you're the Grey Gang, and I know it's possible. If I can catch a fish in the middle of nowhere, then we can get this video to 10,000 likes. No way to get your adrenaline pumping than to catch your PB. And then realize that it's not your PB. But anyways, let's keep fishing and maybe we will. Just for time's sake, I mean, we don't have that much time, guys. I want to use the drop shot for the day's over. So, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and do that. We caught one fish on the little uh, buzz bait. That's not a buzz bait. We already caught one fish there on the wake bait. So now I'm going to try to get one right here on the drop shot. Then we'll move on over to the next pond. Now, here's the little bait. If you don't know how to rig a drop shot, you know, I mean, there's a ton of tutorials on YouTube. But basically what you're going to end up doing is nose hooking this thing. So I'm just going to nose hook it just like that now it's going over here i'm going to throw it right at the base i'm going to throw high percentage cast i want to throw it right at the base of these lay downs that way i'm not wasting my time working this bait in dead water what time is it 6 30 okay we got about 30 minutes and uh yeah sorry guys i'm gonna have to get out of here because i don't necessarily have all the time in the world i've only got 30 minutes left and like i said guys i have to go back i actually have to get in my truck to go to the next location sorry guys for all this rapid movement but let me tell you guys i think we're gonna have a lot more success at the other pond i just i just have a better feeling about it i don't know if this has anything to do with it but the last pond hasn't necessarily had a haircut and every tree on the property cut off but anyways guys i'm gonna clean up this mess and then we'll get in the truck Did you hear that? I got five minutes to go. I mean, I'm not kidding. I knew it. I just knew it. Okay, boys. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go. We ain't got much time. Oh. All right, we gotta get out of here. Turn the radio off. We ain't get demonetized. Goodness, son, I about forgot the rods. I about forgot the rods. Come on, kid. I mean, I'm not kidding. I knew it. I just knew it. Okay, guys, just a little update. I think I'm actually going to extend the challenge like 10 minutes to 7.15, mainly because, you know, on the way over here, like I said, I had to get in my truck. I got behind some grandma going like 22 miles an hour. I mean, yeah, sure, it's kind of cheating the challenge, but that's kind of the perks of being the tournament director. But anyways, guys, here's the pond. Here we go, boys. We're at Mon oh, my gosh. There's like eight fish right there. They're bluegill, which they're probably not going to bite my crankbait, but that really doesn't matter because we're just going to cast right in here, right by the cattails. Here we go guys here we go we're starting pond number two i think we can do really good here i think i have a lot of potential now we just gotta take our time and well make the right choices and they'll be handing me the trophy before i even know it there he is just like i said so it didn't take long and we've already hooked up with a 15 pound smallmouth bass get on up here son get on up here just kidding guys it's only like a four pound largemouth we're gonna make it interesting i still can have a random fishing scale but we're gonna go ahead and weigh this bass mainly because why not you feel me um I don't know if you guys see that, but we got a solid 0.35 pounds. Wow, what a monster. But anyways, guys, let's keep going. Like I said, I think we can get a lot of bass here. There's a lot of potential in this pond. This is the kind of place where classics are won. Ah! Here we go, I'm hitting up this riprap bank. Solid riprap. Wouldn't be surprised one itsy bitsy bit if I don't get bit right here. Three, two, 
one. Oh, there's no way I just done that. I was thinking joking, but I was so, oh my goodness. How does that even work, people? But anyways, just like I called it, man, I've never called anything that good in my life. I just waved at a guy because he was looking at me funny. Probably because I'm yelling to myself. But uh, just a little note. He didn't wave back. And... There we go. We'll see you later, Jimmy. On to the next one. I'm not gonna lie, guys. That the, It was some good pizza. You're kidding me. That's seriously not even funny. That's not funny, dude. I didn't even get to cast it. That was my first cast. Don't be like this. I'm done. I quit. Be sure to like, subscribe, go check out his shop, kendallgray1.com slash shop. Also check out Kendall Gray 2. That's his second channel. Uh, hashtag Jesus, hashtag Gray Gray.